It's a shovel. Well, there's a shovel I could use at the cemetery. Well, now I can dig up stuff at the cemetery. Well, that didn't work. Oh man. Well, that didn't oh, work. Man. Well, that okay. didn't work. Oh man. Really? Well, that didn't work. Well, that didn't work. Oh man. They look so okay. fresh. They look like they've been freshly dug up. Pornography. Young man, you're lucky you're delivering that by hand and not through the mails, or I'd have you arrested. Disgusting. But enlightening. <laughs> what the? Manhole key is stuck at the bottom of the manhole. So, I know I, I need the wrench then. I'll bet you I can get the wrench to get that manhole key. Remember the manhole key is here. The photo is, if you didn't watch last night, I took a picture of the principal and the teacher doing naughty stuff in the closet. I don't know what it's going to be used for, but I'm going to show it to everybody to see what happens. Holy Marconi! That's Miss Whaley and Principal Harold, isn't it? Yeah, I took this picture in the broom closet at Gein Memorial. Nice, huh? Disgusting is more like it. Why are you showing this to me? We couldn't agree to a price for my silence. Thought you'd like to know who's educating your kids. Same as any others, I suppose. Most of which wouldn't appreciate this sort of publicity. Better watch out, son. This kind of stuff can come back to haunt you. Did you say hello to your father? Thank God I could use some good news right now. I just got the word. The order turned down my latest application. Looks like we'll be having the wedding at... Oh my goodness! That's Miss Whaley, isn't it? Wrapped around Principal Harrell. As a member of the PTA, I thought you'd be interested. Interested? I'm absolutely Twitterpated. And the rest of the ladies will be too, once I tell them. Hmm. Hello, dear. She's upstairs. Here's my regard. I have not shown it to the cops yet. I don't know what good it'll do. Operate medicine cabinet. This was not a thing. Take the aspirin. A jar of extra strength or a lube. Great for getting in and out of the tight spots. What the frick? Well, I'll take it, I guess. One hour cough medicine. Take. Oh my gosh, I'm getting too much crap. Warning, yeast disinfectant. Not to be used for baking cookies. You can't take that. New zippy vitamin will pick you up. Take that. Tampons. Better ask Stephanie about these. Take the tampons? What? Be sure to roll up the tube from the bottom. Dental floss. 300 yards of it. A scattering of band-aids. Good lord, I just about raided the entire thing. Like, why would he pick up point and clicks, man? Like, I'll pick random things up and they'll be used later. What if I show this to the kid? Yeah. <laughs> How dare you show those disgusting pictures to my baby? Do that again and I'll tell the sheriff. 
Let's do it again and see what happens. What kind of pervert are you? Harassing a little girl like that? You're under arrest. This is your first arrest, Steve. You just remember, we've got a three strikes, you're out rule here in Harvest. But you keep your nose clean, you hear? Pretty sight. Caught Whaley and Harold messing around in the broom closet at Gein Memorial. They do this all the time, apparently. Well, that sort of thing's not against the law, you know. Not much I can do unless they involve the students. Still, I wouldn't show this to Deputy Loomis if I were you. Old and shriveled though Miss Whaley may be, I don't need any more puddles in the paddy wagon. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh man. Say, is that Miss Whaley? And Mr. Harrell in the school broom closet. Man, oh man, wait till the guys at the diner hear about this. I really don't know what the purpose of spreading this around is, but like I don't know what else to do right now. I have a billion items that I could just experiment with, but I take it you wish to be initiated into the mysteries of the Order of the Harvest Moon. Oh, I can just do this. Very well. Know then that securing the application was but the first step on your road to enlightenment. Now you must complete a series of tasks to prove your worthiness as an initiate. What kind of tasks? Minor pranks, really. Oh. Nothing overly difficult. More tests of wit than prowess. But to complete them, you must, if you wish to enter these walls. Minor prank, eh? I'll bet. What have you got in mind? There is in Harvest a man named Mr. Johnson. He owns a tucker. It is his pride and joy. I should like you to put a scratch in it. A scratch? That's all? As I said, a minor prank. Mind you, you're not to damage the vehicle. Merely put a single scratch in it. Once you have done so, return here, and I shall give you your next task. This is weird. Like, I got m missions to do and a point and click? Well... Sorry, Steve. Too tired to talk right now. I just gave the Tucker. Bye now. During the restaurant, he keeps During the day, he keeps watch over his precious truck. So how am I gonna get him to not look at it? I have many items. I guess I could start trying to give him. I think I already showed him this. Now don't that beat all get out. Harold and the original old maid herself. Though I guess the old maid part is history now, huh? Let's put a scratch on this car. What can I use to put a scratch on it? Broom closet key. Hey! What the hell are you doing? Stay out of there! He's not gonna let me. Damn it. I guess I'm supposed to use the key, but I need to get him to look away. Use the shovel on it. 
You rotten son of a bitch, bitch, bitch. Share it. Uh. Oh no. <laughs> uh. there was even combat in this game. <laughs> what? I can't load? Excuse me? Why can't I load? <laughs> Seeing you here again, one way. You've been showing that picture you took of us around town, smearing our sterling reputations. You disgusting filth. Hey, I'm not the one screwing old ladies in closets. I'll have my revenge, Steve. And it will come at the worst possible time. In your most desperate hour. Until then. <laughs> I can't talk to him anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. That scares me. A wrench might be able to help me get that out. Maybe tampons. I don't forget. Oh man. Use the oral lube on the manhole key. Then you pick up the manhole key. Alright, now I can go into manholes, I assume. Nightfall descends upon harvest. Okay, so now it's nighttime. I've never actually like, been or wandering the areas at night. Wonder if the Cemetery is all creepy. Alright. Small suction section of the wall has been resealed due to water damage. A rusted grate is bolted onto the damp floor. A coat of moisture is formed along the surface of the wheel valve. Wait, corroded wall? There's a tiny indentation in the concrete. I didn't see that corroded wall. How about that? Hey now! Hey! Wait, is there anything in here? Not that I can see. Empty can oil cans litter the floor. A large oil pan filled with lugs and bolts. Alright, here we go. Let's try and raid this place before we scratch the car. An old rusty pitchfork. I knew it. Take it. This dolly might be useful after the wedding. What? Taking a dolly? You have a big pocket. What are you doing? Stop. Examine the window. It won't let, the window's been bricked up and sealed off. 
Mr. Johnson has a myriad of goodies on his tool bench. Well, let's check it out. The carrying case is filled with nothing but lint and sawdust. A rubber mallet, useful for gophers. This flashlight is missing batteries. <gasps> Phillips screwdriver! I need one! Finally! A heavily used tool sharpener and sander. I wonder if I could use that sand, that sharpener for me. What are you doing to yourself? Stop pulling feathers! This gas can had a similar model to the Postmaster's gas can. Edged on the side of the blowtorch reads, thinking of you, Edna. How many license plates does Muster Johnson need for October in one year? Faded posters in 1948, Sexiest Tomboy Award. The annual blood drive has been marked down for the upcoming Saturday. I thought for sure I'd take that mallet. Alright, I guess I've got everything. Garbage bags are piled up against the wall. Let's scratch this car. Oh man. Did it. That was a... I think that scene got cut off or something. Alright, well I scratched the car. For some reason I missed a cutscene. I must have clicked on accident. I could use the screwdriver on this bars. I'm scared to find out what I'm gonna see if once I do this. Let's see. Screwdriver on. Security bars. There's usually more than one trap to stop intruders. I'm going to jail for breaking into my own house. This is your first arrest, Steve. You just remember. <laughs> this scene. <laughs> oh my gosh. Walt, it's just me. What do you want? Did the llamas send you? No, the llamas, they fear That's me. good. I remember you. You're the soldier I sent to check on the fireman. Did you find evidence of commie infiltration? They're as pink as Moscow. Oh, man, I'm scared to do this. That's what I thought. The kookaburras told me. But I wouldn't listen. They lie so much. But now my crust is golden brown. Can't you hear the timer ding? Wait, what? No! Why did he shoot me? <laughs> Joe, come on. Come on, Jinjo. Well, I can go into the fire department? <laughs> He's under the blanket. <laughs> Jeez, what are you doing here? Just standing here, waiting to be drawn. You just hang out here. All the time. I'm not a person, Steve. I'm an object. You'll do well to remember that. A person is his job. Someday you'll understand it. And if you don't, it won't matter. Because you'll be dead. Dead? Have you gotten your lodge application in yet? Good. You may survive yet. <laughs> He's just hiding under a blanket. What? 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 This is your first arrest. Put me to bed, officer. I must have tried stealing something and I didn't even notice. I, I clicked like a vase in the background and I immediately just got put to put in jail. Maybe if I leave the covers on that guy's head, I can steal something. Oh, this game. <laughs> this game, you guys. I 
I don't get what I got put in jail. Examine the wall light. The lights are too high up to reach. That dog is so freaking annoying. Well, that didn't work. You know, I wonder if I'm gonna have to put that dog to sleep or something to get him out of here. Oh, man. Examine the painting on the wall. Picture of a phallic like Strucker standing there. I really don't get why I went to jail. That's so weird. Is it because I'm in... It's probably because I'm... That's probably exactly what it is. I'm, I'm this trespassing. This is your first arrest, Steve. You just remember, we've got a three strikes, you're out rule here in Harvest. 